Former Baylor football coach Art Bryles will return to the sidelines just three years after being caught in the middle of a scandal. Yeah, the scandal happened in 2016 when an investigation found that more than a dozen women had been sexually assaulted by some of his players. Holly Sofort joins us now here in the studio. And Holly, this is a huge mm -hmm. controversy. Yeah, and actually since leaving Baylor, Bryles has had a hard time finding a job in the States. He was actually working in Italy back in 2018, according to ESPN. But now he's back in Texas after being picked up by a school district that's just a few hours away from Baylor. <laughs> Applause on Friday as the Mount Vernon School Board unanimously votes to hire Art Bryles. They make a Skype call to the former Baylor football coach to let him know he's made the team. I'm extremely uh, tickled myself. Bryles was fired from Baylor in 2016 after an investigation found at least 17 women had been sexually assaulted by 19 of his players. Baylor officials declined to comment on his hire. Is it disappointing? Absolutely. Is Dr. Emma Wood is a psychologist in Waco in? who treated four of those victims. She says this hire hurts their healing process. When you have somebody that was associated with facilitating perpetrators committing sexual assault and protecting them, and you see those people continuing to have success in their lives, be employable, while well, you are crippled by your PTSD or working really hard to manage it every day, that doesn't feel like justice. The Mount Vernon ISD superintendent says the district went through a vetting process before hiring Bryles. But on Tuesday, he admitted to reporters that nobody talked to any of the sexual assault victims. There are some women that have bravely come forward and those, those stories should have been taken into consideration. Wood says this hire sends the wrong message to people who commit these offenses. There's not going to be learning for Art Bryles, for Baylor University, for any of the people involved. When you do something so egregious, a natural consequence to that would be to lose the ability to do that thing. You are highly supported and we are looking forward to you being a title. But Mount Vernon ISD feels otherwise, signing Bryles on to coach students for the next two years. And before being hired at Mount Vernon, Bryles tried getting a job at Southern Miss earlier this year, but backlash caused that opportunity to fizzle out. But Bryles also has his share of supporters posted on our KXXV mobile app. We've got a tweet from a former Baylor football star who's congratulating him. And it is interesting that this dropped on Friday night, mm -hmm. you know, where a lot of people are out doing stuff. They're not really paying attention to uh, breaking news. So, right, that, yeah. and it was actually released later in the afternoon, too. So a lot of people were saying, oh, maybe taking advantage of that three-day weekend. Yeah, exactly.